Hello, I am Odet Nagi. This is my second video tutorial. In the previous video tutorial, I told you how to run Turbo Prolog and Turbo C++ in a full screen mode using DOSBox. In this video tutorial, I will tell you um, how to set the directory path in, in the TCC setup, in the TCC software so that you can so that you can uh, run compile as well as debug your files when you are running Turbo C++ using DOSBox. For this, firstly open the DOSBox. <coughs> now write mount command M O U N T mount then drive on which you mount to mount. I am writing C colon then space then the path where that folder is present, TCC folder is present. I have it on J so I am writing J colon backslash TCC. Okay. Hit enter. Now the message has appeared, it has successfully mounted. Now what is happening in this in this uh, in this mount command is basically it is copying the content it is mounting the contents of which are present inside the TCC to the C drive ok wait a minute I will show you yeah all the contents which are present inside this TCC folder like include folder lib library files and all these files they are now mounted to the C drive ok inside the DOS box now the next step is to Now the next step is to go to the drive C where all the contents have mounted. Now execute that Turbo C++ file, exe file, hit enter. Now this is basically a test file. Uh, firstly I will show you what, will, what errors will occur if uh, you don't change your directory. Just compile it yeah it is showing that it is unable to open the include file also in dot h it is not getting the header file because the path the directory paths are not correct okay so for this for checking these errors go to options then directories now change the path of include directory to C colon backslash include okay because that now the TCC folder now the contents which uh, are present inside the TCC folder they have been they have moved to C drive inside the DOS box so no need to write TC okay just write C colon backslash include now in the similar way make it C colon backslash lib now in the source directory change it to C colon backslash now click OK now check compile now it has now it show now it is compiling and now it is not showing any error it is compiling successfully now another thing which I will recommend uh, recommend you to use your mouse to select the options don't use shortcuts okay now another thing which uh, will help you is whenever you want to run your turbo C++ using DOSBox e, uh, you, sh you should mount it to the same drive each time ok so I will recommend you to mount it to C drive each time you run your turbo C++ by doing this way you will not have to change the directory path each time you run turbo C++ okay thank you for watching the movie